All right, what's up everybody? This is MPK, Mr. Pretty Kitty. For those that don't know who I am, we're coming at you with another commentary stream. I'm gonna go ahead and just get straight into it. Link versus Bubble Bubble. Getting it started with <laughs> Linkster versus Bubble Boost, Pat versus Ari. All right, making that space again. Using those short hops, those are definitely unsafe. Oh, getting open up with that 6B. There's that 5B, that neutral rope. Oh, these JC, the short hop JC reset, another classic. Back in the blender, crossing up this time. Not able to follow up with a knockdown or anything, just going to let it drop out. Is that JC? Disrespecting it, you see that 5A, that uh, standing jab. A lot of staggered pressure here. <laughs> Straight up throw, nice teleport to get out of that corner. That is a cross up set, uh, situation. Ooh, we got pickups, new pickups. Nice block on the uh, non-cross up J uh, JC. Rope, this may finish it out. There it is. And eating the fruit, just getting that, just getting some fruit in you. You gotta have your fruit. All right, J uh, 6C. Push block punishing it with the 2-2-A, the light stomp. We in the corner, getting that rope magic and using that chain uh, Gatling really for uh, Arizona with the 5A 5A. And since links are actually tech forward, it causes the cross up, which cave may allow the 6A to come out. Ooh, nice falling JA. <laughs> Not that much recovery on whip air throws. Using that dead angle to. Oh, just eating the body slam. We in the corner now. And there's a throw. No tech. This may finish it out. There it is. All right, round three. Ooh, nice block. These little stomps as pressure. Oh, push block and the super. What a classic. I thought push block guard cancel was gone. <laughs> and just as I said, that push blocking is a valid defensive option. You can just push block normal the way so you can create some space. And usually they're uh, very. Some normals have a lot of recovery to them. So you can't push block and still get the punish. Oh, not blocking after teching. There's that Dagonal again. Using that short hop JC to cover both options. Nice block on that body slam. Try to meaty 5C to get that plus frame so you can get uh, some advantage and go for some like, more pressure there. Oh, nice anti air 6A stuffing any jump in, really. It's a very good button for jump uh, against uh, jump ins. Magic dash. We got a reset? Nope, we're going for damage. Get all the damage you can. Oh, that was a free punish, but opt to go up to the defensive option and just wake up super that oh, that what a choice. Just bet the farm there, <laughs> use wake up super and bubble with the punish. Kazumi versus not a noob. All right, let's go. Let's see let's see some new people action. Should be uh Oleander versus Paprika maybe? I can't remember who Kazumi plays, but hopefully it'll be an exciting match here. Oh, I was right. <laughs> Good read by me. Let's go, round one. Round start, JC. Getting in there with some damage. Nice combo from Kazumi. Going for the knockdown. Ooh, nice block on the uh, body splash. Got some Oleander BNBs. Ooh, drop combo. First one today. Using that 2C hard knockdown in the read. Finally, someone's reading. Oh, but the, pun the teleport gets punished by the, the body slam. Ooh, wake up buttons. I think a lot of people just wake up with buttons these game in this game. Ooh, that drops out. Very high juggle decay. Oh, <laughs> the body splash is just opening up. Not a noob here. Ooh, there it is again. Gotta check to see when Paprika is actually. Oh my gosh, just. Overheads galore. <laughs> you gotta check to see when Paprika is actually trying to charge. Usually when she's just sitting there crouching full screen, she's charging uh, up something. Just like that. <laughs> that was probably uh, body splash again. Just a, uh, 
going for that damage there and it and it hits we got fred double teleport goes low more magic Ooh, that was almost the pickup there it is there's the pickup ground bounce Ooh, using that 6d to keep him there we tried to up back jab but the jab doesn't have a big hitbox on it so it whiffed four attack roll does he block oh it just goes through no punish though 6c that's an odd 6c combo jab and a 6c it works though delayed sparks ah uh, there it is again getting hit doing double spark and a cross under launcher <laughs> Getting a little wacky there. There's the super. That'll finish it out. That'll definitely finish it out. Now the dude's got to figure out when Kazumi's trying to charge something. Because he's getting hit by that body splash a lot. And there's the cross up spark teleport. Ooh, dropping out. You got to figure out which normals actually cause uh, the opponent to actually lift up. Not all normals have the same amount of uh, lift on them. And there's that bouquet. Uh, finally blocks the body splash. Launcher. Ground bounce. Super. It drops out. You can do super in the air. If you're not confident, it's not a hit on the ground. Wake up. Throw. Let's go. Oh, no kissy face. A lot of drop combos today. Ground bounce. There's a the super. Here comes Fred. Poison the hood. Oh, just a raw cartwheel. And a cross under jab. It was the wrong way, but it still hit. Super. Oh, it misses. Trying to press buttons here. Trying to disrespect Fred. Nice block on the overhead. No punish, though, but it's hit. Just, oh, my goodness. That was a wacky paprika. Very wacky paprika. That is the first time I've seen cross under jab actually hit. Oh, we got a new person here. Cinema Muscles? <laughs> Cinemaldehyde? I'm going to call him Cinema. All right, just that makes it a lot easier on me. Cinema versus Mustache. Good seeing you come out. Oh, he's a Pat player. Okay. All that velvet, and then he comes out with Pat. <laughs> Ooh, cross under cartwheel. Misses. And gets opened up by the JB. We got a drop combo, though. Fruits on screen. Combos. Drop combos, and there's the OTG and the up back JC making it cross up. Not expecting the overhead. Nice Bork, but it was not, it was it went unpunished. Ooh, just charging that overhead. 6C. Ooh, try to go for it again to go for the anti air, but it misses. Using that chopper dog. Ooh, stayed in front. 2C. Trying to, oh, did air back dash for some reason. Had the combo, but dropped it out. Mate, could have went for a dog summon there. 6C. That first hit of JA doesn't have a lot of hit sun on it. So it causes a lot of dropouts. All right. Going for charges there. 2A. We got combos. No, we don't. There we go. There's a super. That'll finish it out. And those damage buffs for Paprika is so apparent. Round two, let's go. Ugh, just eating that JB, that jumping medium. And Launcher whipping on crouches. It's completely missing on crouches there. Ugh, double JC, no pickup. Nice block, that instant block. You see instant blocks occur when they flash white. Uh, try to go for the JA follow-up. A lot of drop combos here. Bork. There's a dog summon. Oh, the delayed JC. Uh, short hop up back JA. A lot of unorthodox combos. Oh, there's that miss Bork again. Just super. This is safe. This is active plus. Gotta hold it. Uh, double JC. Double overheads. Bork again. Going for that damage. There it is. It's a lot of stagger time on that fork. Able to do a free summon or uh, go straight into oh, just oh, it picks it up. Oh my goodness, just raw bouquet in the in the two A that actually picked up. That was insane. Getting caught pressing buttons in the air. 
Ooh. Caught the start of a... Ooh, there's a standing combo. Love seeing those. Oh, just overheads galore. 5D. The uh, 5C there. The uh, tap bottom. And super. Ooh, double JC. Going for that damage. Going for the meaty super. And, and the chopper overhead. Wasn't able to see, see it. Super again. A lot of meters usage. Wow, was that a cross up and then stayed on the other side? Super. Picks it up. Boop. Picking a basket. Nope. Going for the setup. Meaty jabs. Oh, and launcher. Oh. Super. The launcher whip. It went to the throw. 2A again. Bouquet. That's unsafe. Super. Will this finish? Oh, it drops out. Oh, my goodness. Excellent match from Cinema and Mustache there. That was definitely wacky. I love seeing wacky Pat play. Thank you, Cinemas, for coming out and playing on stream. Yeah, I really appreciate that. No matter what skill level you are, if you come out and play on stream, that's actually amazing. I'm glad to see y'all come out. All right, Link versus Corin. All right, let's go get it on. Paprika versus Arizona. Want to add Wetzel, I believe it is. Ask if you can buy this game that. No, it's coming out February 23rd, 18. So it's coming out soon. Nice block on that jump in. No instant block though. Facing out that bouquet to make it uh, safe on block. And just eating a jump in there. Kissy face. Nope. Going for the ground bounce. There's a kissy face. What's the setup? Oh, went for throw. But that's not real, so he got hit by the jab. And that's that unsafe stomp. You can't do that up close. Kissy face. What's the setup? There's the throw. Going for those command throws a lot more now. In that easy damage in with the BNB and a drop combo. Nice block on the uh, the JC. Nice block on that meaty 6B, but it seems like since it was so meaty, it was actually safe. Usually it's minus 12. Ooh, there's a 6B again. Super, level two. Going for the setup. Yup. Going for the damage, actually. Oh, uh, and the stomp made it whip coming out high. Double stomp. Dead angle for some reason. That was actually on Oh, it just stops it with the fruit. <laughs> fruit beats armor. <laughs> Write it down, folks. Rock hard wheel in the 6C. Going for the launcher. Kissy face. What's the setup? There's a throw. Just going for throws this time. Getting a lot of leeway with throws. Kissy face. Going low. That 2C pops him up. They're able to use that ground bounce. Oh, it makes the throw with the throw beat with the, the short hop JC. Lix is making a lot of good decisions here. Kissy face. Fruit. 60. Oh, and beats the tech roll with the throw. What a read. Super. Oh, this may be a perfect. And it is. Junae versus Bub 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 Bub. All right. And there's the velvet. We got the chocolate. The, ch the chocolate surprise velvet. Let's go. That velvety goodness. Using that 5A. Very good button for uh, stagger pressure. Doesn't really have any strings for velvet, though. Launcher whiffs. JC has a lot of active frames on it. Icicle. Picks it up. Stack, uh, going for the for air loop. There's a shatter. Super. Decent damage on that. Using the icicle to cover the, that, that space and that uh, icicle magic. Oh, and the boot ain't fixing it up. The launcher. Okay, see? Kiss face. There it is. Fruit. Fruit's on the screen. And there's the invisible reversal. Nice block. Nice punish. Okay, AJB. Cross on her. Going for the corner here. It just wakes up Cartwheel. We tumbling. We tumbling for breakfast. Getting that Pilates in. Kissy face. Fighter plant. Super. Going for the setup. Yes, he is. What's the setup? Stayed in front. Actually, show up backwards with the JC there, the jumping heavy. And is eating ice for breakfast. He is extremely thirsty. Going for that ice. Oh, and cartwheel. That might have chipped, but it seemed like it hit, so. 
And Tycho Rainbow asked, was that a fairy picking up the broccoli for it? Yes, that was a fairy feeding Velvet the, uh, the broccoli. Nice use of the push block to push him back into the icicle range. Ooh, that shadow almost picked up. And Bouquet, what a good option in neutral. It just gorillas through so much. Nice block after the icicle call. Got to use that. You got to have really good defense to play, uh, Velvet. Got to have extremely like phenomenal defense to play her since she doesn't have a lot of offensive options. He's face, body plant, super. Going for the setup. What's for breakfast? Overheads! We going in deep with the body slams. Try to go for the kissy face for another setup. Possibly a uh, fruit and a... Oh, try to go for the overhead there during the block stream, but it... Velvet does have at least the uh, the magic icicles. And just ducked underneath the jumping heavy. We got wind loops. Super. Level two? Nope, going for damage. Velvet does get a lot more damage when letting the super rot instead of going for the level two. Get the magic back. This may finish it out. Stagger in the super? Yep, this will finish it out. Nice use of velvet there. <laughs> Round three. Let's get it on. And a lot of respect. That See, that is definitely punishable. Most velvet buttons are. Getting that space. Icicles. Not using the eruption there. there and just as I said that, there's the eruption. And using that launcher for an anti air, that is extremely unsafe. Shatter, that's also unsafe. A lot of risky options here. <laughs> nice block. Nice use of that 5A to try to get him back. JC, we got slowdown. We're going to the Matrix here. JC. Picks up with the J the, the, the jab. 2B. Uh, oh man, 2C. What great buttons. Caprika has extremely long range buttons for herself. And you saw the uh, nice defense there from Bubble Boots. Creating that space. Trying to use Icicle to uh, give himself some advantage. But any Icicle call on any button but for uh, Velvet is actually unsaved. You can't really just call it out like that. You have to use magic to make yourself safe. Using that Falling JB. There it is. Win loops. 2B to kick break that space. There's a super. Made it safe in the instant block. Going in the shatter, super. That'll finish it out. Good stuff from Bubble. Thanks for pulling out the Velvet for us and, and actually winning with Velvet. That's <laughs> that's surprising. All right, Kato versus Ark. That's fine. We're getting some Pap versus uh, Tina there. We got a lot of paprika now. A lot of paprika. That uh, might make the dish a little too sweet there. All right, there's that Spyro cup palette. We got up backs and we got body slams. JC, picking up with that jab. Going to the corner. No kissy face though. And they all oh, tried to go for the, the conversion off of that JC. Stayed in place. That was almost a cross up. Teleport B. <laughs> oh, just using Arcanel going up to the pot to all the way up to the high uh, to the screen. Meaty 2A, you gotta start blocking low. JC, to finish it out. Now people understand that Paprika has extremely dangerous uh, reset potential off of her kissy face. She can go high with the cartwheel, which is a 17 frame overhead. She can go low with 2A, and she can do the command grab. It's actually a lot scarier than uh, Arizona's mix ups. Cartwheel. Using that teleport in the same place. Gotta start seeing Arcanel use uh, 236A, the ground bounce with Tina. Instead of going for that jab air dash. And just as I said that, there it is again with the short hop low. Fruits on screen. Can't use jab. Trying to go for that short hop, but crosses up with the JA. That jumping light. We got combos. No, we don't. And Bouquet the truck. <laughs> This gets you. There's the throw beating that tech roll. Cinder roll super. This may finish it out. 
Yes, it does. And people are starting to understand what pressure Paprika has. She's actually incredibly scary in the corner, since you can't press but you can't press jab the fastest button you have in the game. So a lot of options are just nullified if you try to press buttons above uh, fruit. Good match from Kato, just showing up and taking names. Ebb versus New. Okay, we got Ebbert on screen. Shoutouts to Ebbert once again for all those Steam avatars and TFH avatars he's giving out. He's just drawing up a storm, giving out amazing artwork. And we've got Shadow Realm Tina on screen. Nice use of that jumping JC, that jumping heavy to challenge whatever Ebbert was going to do. You saw the instant block, so that was... Oh, 6A, what an anti-air! <laughs> I love seeing Tina, uh, Tina get anti-air by Oleander 6A. It's just insane how fat, how good you have to be with anti-air so you do that. And using that flip as a quick get in covers a lot of forward space. And there's the dive kick. Tried to push black afterwards. Dive kick has a lot of hit stun, so you're able to get a lot of combos off of it. Decent damage. Nice throw, catching that back tag. And that volcanic bash has a lot of hit stun on it as well, so you can go for more combos after that. And there's a super to finish it out. Quick first round there, about 24 sec uh, 23 seconds. Dash up 5B. Very good neutral button. Very good poke. Ooh, I recognize that Nanadu was prepared for that anti-air and flew backwards with the JA. Flying over that spark. There's the J the 60 again. What amazing anti-air and the cross-up Medusa head. That was definitely a big damage combo there, but didn't pick up off of it. Sparks, going for reads. Not many pages on screen. Got more magic here. Nice back dash, actually. Oh, that was almost a cross of uh, JB, but ever pressing buttons. Using it as an anti-air. Oh, just falling JB, just falling buttons. That's definitely a good option. JC, super. Red's in the house. Not using that charge, uh, Wendy. There it is. Gotta use the charge as well. 2C, meaty spark. Wall fist. There it is again. Oh, there's a dive kick. Ooh, just stayed out of range of that wall, uh, wall fist. Ooh, could have blocked and push blocked in the page, but tried to press the button afterwards. Possibly trying to anti air. Ooh, nice block on the cross under 6A. And, and recognizing that he did block it and then pressing JA to punish. Extreme awareness from Nadanu here. Double jump combos. 2C. We got Reed. Let's go with the magic. No magic page still. And nice block on that cross up, but doesn't block low afterwards. The jumping jack has doesn't have a lot of hits on uh, blocks on it. 5C. It's 6C. Covers a lot of vertical space as well. Nice instant block. Nice block on the flip too. Excellent defense. 6A. Gotta use 2B afterwards. It does have a uh, just as good as hitbox for uh, anti-airing as 6A does. And not taking the bait off of those flies. Nadanu is focused right now. He wants that win. Nice use of up black to stop that crossover too. Not really seeing any pages from Nadanu as well. He does have the option to use pages to cover that screen space. Four tech buttons. And the super drops out. Not punished either. Double JC gets, gets hit by the standing. And we got drops. Flip out. Puts some stuff in the corner, but it gets the hit. Super. Let's see Fred. He's in the house. Using that 1D. Uh, Could have used 1D one more time to get pick up off of that overhead. And super to finish it out with a chip. Not a new brought his A game today. That was some amazing anti airs. Excellent match from New ver uh, versus uh, Everett. That was extremely entertaining. We got Rich versus Cinnamon. Cinema here. We got Pap versus Pap, I believe, with that fake out with the velvet. All right, we got 300 ping as well. Oh, he brought out the Oleander. <laughs> 60 starting it out. No combo afterwards. 
Got air sparks. Got a lot of spacing going on. Potted plants on screen. And it's gone. No reads after the 2C though. You got teleports. JC, sparks on screen. Using that cut use that spark coverage to get read. Ooh, level three pages on screen. It does stay there on screen, even though Oleander's hit. Tech four trying to get back in space to that uh, level three page. It's still there. It lasts about ten seconds. Now it's gone. Gotta get that magic back. Using that hard knockdown. No reads though. Two C, going in the pay and the, uh, here's a T-shirt. Reads the four tech roll. It <laughs> gets a little bit of magic there, uh, a little bit of meter there with the broccoli eat. And cinema, and cinema is just allowing uh, Rich to get that magic, but that's super punish on that spark. Nice defense. Just deciding to take the the buttons there. Oh, nice cross on spark as well. Actually, navigating through the potted plant and going for the quick kill with a super doesn't want to. Uh, take any risk going into a combo. Got round two. Let's go. 5C and the 2C. That is a hard knockdown. And there's another spark cross up. No combos afterwards. Just going for the read. Pages on screen. Nice block. And that spark just completely shutting out any cartwheels. Using that spark again to cover the screen. Uh, there's a the level three page that does give a lot of magic as well. And there's that teleport B again. And Super actually falls into it. That was not a whip Super. That doesn't count, that doesn't count towards the, the count. <laughs> and Apples do get regenerate health. You can use it to get some health back. A lot of wacky pickups here. A lot of drops. That may be because of the 300 ping. Raw Super, it, it hits. Oh, there's the damage. Super. Text forward recognizes that it's whipping. We got a pickup. Nice awareness that it doesn't cross up. Dinner roll. We eating sweet today. Ooh, and just presses some buttons to win it out here with the jabs. Good stuff from Rich. Wow, it's a, <laughs> it's a Teenage Mutant Ninja Paps. <laughs> you guys are crazy. Born versus Bubble, that's fine. Velvet versus Velvet. Now, I, I don't know about that. That may be something special to see. Oh, we got Velvet Mirrors. Let's go. We chucking ice today. Turn your ice machines on high, because we're getting chilly out here. 5C into the eruption. There's some more eruption. That does a lot of damage on hit. That's a starter, at least. 2C in the eruption. Not far enough to punish it. We got jabs. Straight up eruption. Let's go. That is her only low. And actually picks it up with the JC. Using that e invincible uh, reversal that does a, uh, the ground tumble and picks it up with the launcher. Icicles do disappear when Elvelva gets hit. Icicles on stream. Getting hit by the stray uh, ice. That does a lot of damage. <laughs> I believe that uh, two icicles and eruption on hit full screen does about uh, as much as a regular BNB. &B. Regular combo there. There's some more uh, eruption lows. Ice is flying. Ooh, that 2C does have a lower hitbox on it. So you can low profile under a lot of things. Try to do the da uh, micro dash in the 5C to pick it up. But it's a little too far. 2C buttons. Just using that icicle coverage to make some uh, actually real strings. That back dash to make it uh, to actually get the combo going. Ice loops, super. Oh, and it drops out, and no punish, no solid punch at all. The eruption is actually negative two as well, so it's not real pressure for it. You can't just go back and do jab again. Does that low again? Icicles do have a different hitbox on it as well. It's actually a lot different when you see the hitbox for it. 
Nice read on the four attack. Mini eruption. Ooh, getting hit by that 1D. Shatter. There's the super. And pose. Who's up next? New versus Arc. It's your thing. It's gonna be Tina versus, uh, I believe it's Pat. Oh, Tina versus Tina. Let's go. Ow! This is not a new. He was originally the Oleander player, but he's now picking Tina for some reason. Trying to bust out the flame kicks. And there's a patented arc now BNB. Going to the corner. Dive kick. Ooh. Trying to go for a second ground bounce. Ooh, 6 A just anti-airing. And anti-airing again with the launcher. Ooh, just eating those instant air dashes. Ooh, different combos. I love seeing different combos for different uh, all the characters. Super decent damage. What's the setup? Using that flip out to get out. <laughs> was that a cross up? It sure was. There's that BNB again. Decent damage. Always corner carry. Seems to be dropping out a lot for Arcanel. Uh, and that launcher is definitely unsafe. Arcanel re recognizing and using that 5B to punish. Ooh, just jump back into air dash. Remembering that Arcanel does love pushing 5B on uh, round start. Getting opened up by that overhead. It does ground bounce on hit. Oh, and it whips. A uh, nice block on the overhead as well. That dive kick. I don't think it's overhead, but nice block anyway. Recognizing that firecracker kicks are punishable on block. That's super. What's the setup? Ooh, nice use of flip to get out. And those buttons are really far reaching. Able to convert it off of practically anything on screen. Back dash and create that space. Good use of fly going overhead. <laughs> we got head bangs. Oh, what a call out. What a block too. Not a new is definitely not a new 2C. It is a soft knockdown, but it has a lot of uh, lift on it. So Tina's able to fly cancel and do things afterwards. Oh, nice use of that air dash delay JA. Not a new has some Definitely good strings here. Wow, making it whip and then going into the volcanic crash command grab. Wow, that was insane. Cross up. Arcano's in his zone now. He's in the corner. Ooh, they whipped again. Arcano's might have <laughs> shaky toes. Dropping again. He's dropping a lot of things now. Buttons winning out. For not a noob here. He might be able to get it out with a super. Maybe a level two. I'd like to see a level two combo, but he uses the second ground bounce to get the soft knockdown. And Arcanel picks it up. Gets crossed up with the JA, the jumping light. Super to finish it out. Not a noob takes it. <laughs> that was some insane play from not a noob there. Absolutely incredible Tina play. That was definitely incredible. And, and you guys are so silly. <laughs> Corn versus mustache next. Oh, man. Palm versus Arizona. Let's get it on. And Korn's actually taking a, a more apprehensive approach. Trying to gauge what Mustache is going to do, actually reacting to what's going on. Nice backdash, actually escaping that 2D rope. That low rope there, that unblockable rope. And the meaty 6B actually whips the late launcher. By much that works. Getting around the corner, but he's put back in the corner. JC ground bounces. Or JC again. Pressing buttons. Ooh, and the air tech into the medium. Ooh, nice block on the uh, air tech, but gets hit by the 6B, which is still overhead. Nice block on the JC there, the jumping heavy. Ooh, catching those buttons. A lot of people are actually pressing buttons here. They may be push block attempts, but sometimes you just gotta block it out. Better to be safe than sorry. 
Ooh, just air dash forward. 2C, that is punishable. If it isn't canceled. Yeah, well, basically it's punishable even if it is canceled. Ooh, nice use of chopper, that overhead. That stomp is punishable in effect, but you can use it at, at a space range, at a good range, possibly max range to make it safe. Ooh, just dashing up using rope. Oh, we got waiting. We in the Matrix, and he still picks it up, going into Super. Woo, that, <laughs> we playing hopscotch with the rope here. Chopper's on screen. You have two uses for Chopper. That's the second usage, it's gone. Nice air tech, love seeing people air tech. Guy starts air teching more. Super, no, pit, no second, uh, no level two there. Ooh, ooh, those heavy hits sound so dangerous. Ugh. All right, round three. Let's get it on. An air throw. What a round starter. Oh, dash up six A. Definitely a big button. Can use it just as so. Two C. JC double JC. We got heavy hits here. Lots of damage. Bork, super. JC. Ooh, dashing into that short of uh, those, uh, that jumping heavy. Nice forward tech to get out of the corner. Sandy Pup is there. Pumping that, that stomp. Ooh, reading the, the 2C. Uh, tried to pick it up with rope. Could've just ran up and used buttons to pick it up. Much less has a hit. In the corner, Bork. 2C. There's the Bitey Pup. Nice throw. And the throw finishes out. Decent damage. Good stuff from Mustache there. Ever wants to fight Kazumi. Oh, oh, that's fine. We'll go ahead and get one match in. One more match in. I know Ever has been wanting some more screen time. So we're going to go ahead and give it to him. Cinnamon Rolls on screen. And now it's gone. <laughs> Nice cross up, they actually, actually comboed. Okay. Oh, there's that body splash. Decent meter gain off of that JC. Good use of that 5B for neutral. It's a very fast, very long reaching button. Oh, delayed overhead. Oh. Nice block on that 6C. That is definitely punchable on every single hit of it. But it is a frame trap, so you have to decide whether or not to push a button. I'd rather just push block it myself. A lot of drop combos here. Nice block. The cancels in the launcher. Trying to fame trap it. 6C. JC. This may finish it out with super. Nope. Drops it out. Oh, it gets hit by the flip out. Enters JC. The jumping heavy. Super. This may be it. And it is. Very clutch from Edbert. Actually blocks the JC, the, the cartwheel this time. Gets hit by the launcher. Gotta recognize that they're both unsafe. And just block it. <laughs> Possibly instant block it. We got corner carry. Super. Level two. There it is. Let's see some buttons. Ooh, drops out actually. Still in level two phase. Gets hit by the overhead on the second of six E. Here's a t-shirt. Okay. Ooh, drops out. Picks it up, jabbing the six E. That is really odd to see, really. He loves using that six E. That t-shirt. Give me that t-shirt for all day. Okay, that is punishable. At that range, at least. That 5C pickup is insane to see. Ooh, cross under. No tech buttons. 2C drops out as well. Ooh, that damage on a Ross cartwheel. Just as I said that, there's another <laughs> overhead. Just gonna get hit by it. Oh, gotta use cartwheels. Oh, wow, what an anti-air! 
I don't know if that was intentional or not, but it was insane to see. Ooh, that wait. That is the scariest thing to see, just two characters waiting. You see? Volcanic Bash misses. Cartwheel has a good hitbox on it. Able to punish that teleport C. Volcanic Bash, the super hits. The hitbox on it got buffed. We level two. We not, we, we drop a combos. There's another 60, JC. Try to go for another throw. And the flip get the hit, gets the hit. And not taking any chances, uses the super to finish it out. All right, good stuff here. Now, nearing the end of the hour, I'll go ahead and get my matches in as well. And I'll start off with Mustache. And I'm trying to learn a few characters here, uh, a few different characters, so I can we can get some more character representation on. <laughs> Just so that you guys are gonna see another path. Ah. <laughs> I'm pat I'm pat 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 debated. <laughs> Round start, teleport C, let's go! Uh. Ooh, nice actually air, air dash. Doing it again! Nice block! Tried to do the short hop, but it didn't come out. <laughs> All right, go ahead. Not a noob. Uh, I didn't want that color. No, I'm not pink. Ah, nice recognition. Shatter. Nice forward jump. Ah! 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 
Nice six E. Six A. Pose. Woo. It is definitely a different mindset for playing those characters. Like each character is just basically their own in like universe. <laughs> you guys are so weird. <laughs> I get two more matches in. Let's go with uh, Linkster here. Time to read a book. Ah, they actually hit on the same frame, so my page disappeared. Let's go. Neutral jump, JB. up so much. Good match from Linkster. <laughs> you guys, come on. You guys do something weird every time. Come on. <laughs> Get some bubble action. Ah, uh, I tried to recover in time, but it does have a lot of recovery on it. Baits. I'm in there. Ah, oh, I didn't want back dash, but okay.
Nice super. Very nice super. Teleported afterwards. I was using my JV stuff. Oh, I used the chip. Okay, cool. Uh, I should have did teleport. I wasn't. I wasn't prepared for that. Have a cross up. Super. Level two. I'm in the corner. Use the wall bounce. Okay. Cross up. <laughs> All right, we got arcade sounds. You guys are so silly. Let's go ahead and play the local hero to finish it out here. Let's get it on. Round bounces. Uh. Ah, super. Not the Fred. Ah, uh, it beat my cartwheel. Ah, uh, super! Not Fred! Ah! Uh, damage! Ah! Uh, no! What is this? No! Ah, <laughs> oh, no, Fred!
That was some amazing damage there. Yeah, Fred being used during Black Sun is, uh, is they're aware of it. Yeah, they're aware of Fred being used in Black Sun and they're going to fix that soon. Alright guys, that ends our 12th commentary stream, I believe. Again, this is going to be every Saturday, 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Come on out, port the game, see new updates, talk to players, ask questions, whatever you need to do to find out information about TFH. Uh, you can find it here, you can find it on the unofficial Discord, uh, you can find it on the uh, Fighting Fanatics Discord as well, and you can find it on the TFH forums. Thank everyone in the stream for coming out and supporting us here. Thanks for everyone playing on stream. And thank you for Cinemaldehyde for actually coming out and playing too. Good stuff to you. Uh, a little update on the stream setup here. I actually updated the uh, upgraded my internet package here, so we'll be able to get some higher quality streams uh, if we get some more uh, viewers to come through, so that I can get that Twitch stuff, the uh, Twitch affiliate status, so I can get those uh, different uh, stream qualities, so that people that don't have that awesome internet package can actually watch the stream and uh, join us out here on online. That concludes the commentary stream. I'm glad to see y'all coming out. It's been fun.